Hello, my name is Tracy Simmons, and I edit an online magazine called Creedable.com, which covers religion news and anything. In 2008, the Hartford Current laid off its religion reporter, reducing its face section to a calendar. A few months later, all of the groups pretty much across Connecticut followed suit, including the people I was looking for. Uh, Connecticut has my own reputation of being a secular area. However, uh, recent data shows that only 12% of Connecticut's 3.5 million residents consider themselves to be non-religious. Those people want to know what religious issues are facing the community. Rivia Chaudhry is the president of the Muslim <coughs> Coalition of Connecticut, and she had this to say. We have so many interfaith events and events that talk about social issues and have so much difficulty getting coverage of these events. 10 times out of 10, if we get any media coverage, it's from Credible. So like Rabia said, um, Credible.com is the solution to this problem. Through news writing, multimedia, blogs, and feature writing, in only one year and five months, we've become Connecticut's source for religion news. Um, however, that's not to say that we don't have competition. Susan Campbell writes a religion column and blog for The Current. I'd like to share with you what she had to say. Traditional print media cannot sit still. And if we need any reminder of that, we can just look to websites like Tracy Simmons's Credible. It is smart, savvy, and all over the place, covering religion as traditional print media <coughs> still, but no more. Having a competitor out there like Tracy keeps people like me honest. I know she's keeping an eye out on what's happening. I know she's rapidly become a go-to news source. And if I sit still, she will run rings around me. Uh, so far this month alone, Credible's raised $850. Based on that figure, we anticipate Credible to bring in $10,000 this year, which is a 25% increase from last year. So I'd like to leave you with this quote from uh, Lisa Miller, who is the religion editor of Newsweek. She said, religion needs translators, mediators, who can be compassionate but skeptical. So by supporting Credible, not only can you help fill the void that Connecticut newspapers have left behind, but you can also help tear down the walls of religious misunderstandings that are played in our community. With that, I would like to open it up for donations or <laughs> questions. <laughs> <laughs> quick point of clarification, uh, great presentation. Quick point of clarification: eight hundred and fifty. You said we've raised eight hundred and fifty. So is that donations, or is that also revenue of the ads? That is through ads and donations. Okay, yes. great. Yeah. yeah, can you talk a little bit more about the business model? Yeah. So um, what we're doing right now is we have advertisers on the site that are bringing you money, and we have a lot of people who have made donations to the site. Um, and we also have, you know, we're selling photos, and you know, we can sell some fabulous merchandise, perhaps. Very nice t-shirt. Right? And, um, you know, we're just, we also have new print commissions, and so that's how we're raising the money right now. Are you a nonprofit? No, we're an LLC. LLC. Mm -hmm. How much money do you need? Um, well, I've been reduced to a, a diet of Pop Tarts and coffee. Um, <laughs> so, because this has all been out of pocket. So, uh, you know, I, I think if I could get $10,000 to help me with some marketing, um, some side improvements, and maybe pay some freelancers, that would be really helpful. And, you know, God's my audience, so. <laughs> <laughs> you say we, but is the one person not like it? It is. It's weird. I've learned to, to refer to myself as a we. <laughs> That's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> WBE, not WBI, actually. But um, I do, um, it, it is mostly me, but I also have uh, five bloggers who are local scholars and clergy who have volunteered their time to be bloggers. And then if you'd like more information, I have some brochures. I'd rather have a t-shirt, but it's alright. Which is, which is, um, <laughs> this is my fault, so I'm, I'm particularly the one who notices it. Um, so yes, yeah, thanks. So this is done for us. Peace. Yeah. Um, but but uh, great presentation, great enthusiasm, great examples, great details, and great testimonials. Yeah. Particularly yeah. that are really strong. Yeah. Yeah, did you say that the current went down to just a calendar and then come back later and say they also have a phone? They have, well, the, yes, the religious section, I should say, is gone. Except for the okay. calendar. But they still have a Sunday religion colonist. Okay. It, it was a little bit of a contradiction thing. So I was like, okay, they don't have a calendar. Then you come back later and say, oh, they have a sub-columnist. Okay. So we could uh, okay. otherwise we'll Thank you.